started with local news, Como, that's the ABC affiliate here. It's a rough life for one Seattle dog who appears to have figured out Seattle's mass transit for herself. Then ABC National had come out. Of course, public transportation can be grueling. Eclipse is the one passenger no one complains about when she nods off on top of you. National Enquirer, I think, just had a page last month. Random House release earlier this year, a dog on board. And it's her story in her words. That's the idea from Eclipse's point of view. It, yeah, she's been covered. Hey, I'm Jeff, and this is Eclipse. And this is a bus stop, actually, where she jumped on by herself for the first time. It was crowded then, and I was talking to some friends over here. The bus pulled up, wasn't paying attention to her. She wasn't on a leash, because she goes leashless, and turned around and she was gone. It was panic for a minute, and I was able to figure out she got on the bus. Got on the next bus, figuring where, there's nowhere she would go from here except to the dog park. We had done it a million times. So she had got on the bus and gone by herself. I was just a little worried because it's five or six stops down the road. Got to the dog park, there she was. A relief. And since then, it's become a regular thing. A couple, three times a week. Gets on the bus and heads to the dog park. Yeah, she's got her bus pass here. That's a souvenir left over from her commercial that she did for the transit system here, Metro, to introduce their trip planning app. And so she shot a commercial that was in the form of a little hip hop video called Bus Doggy Dog. And it had her just running around town to promote how easy the trip planner app was. So easy even a dog could do it. So she came from the country and now she's been urbanized over this last couple of years. So buses, escalators, elevators, crosswalks, she's uh, good at navigating all those. When she crosses the streets, especially the arterials and just any street, she'll cross at the crosswalk, she'll wait until the people all cross and go with them. You just, you really have to see her do it. She's good like that. Yeah, it's a dog-friendly city. Uh, I mean, dog-friendly with, with a capital F. There are more dogs than kids right now in Seattle, and especially in this neighborhood. And, and overall, she's a sparkle in everybody's morning, from what I understand when I talk to people, or from what I see when I'm with her and commuters run across her. Always ask about the dog, the smartest dog I've ever known. definitely a people person and she's one of my favorite people what if I hold you would that work better huh that work better <laughs>